if we're not um, looking at ways that we can more broadly share this mission of a land grant with uh, people across the state, regardless of or including how they identify racially or gender-wise or gender identity, sexual orientation, then we're not really living into our land grant mission. So we really need to include this as a lens in all the work that we do in order for us to really live into this opportunity for us to take the education and the research from this land-grant um, university into Michigan communities. What more my gifts are is helping people to understand that this is something that they can apply to everything that they do, whether it's personally or professionally. And then it's also really important for them to understand that this makes us better at the work that we do. We uh, are working within an institution that has specific cultural norms, specific uh, ways of doing things. And the way that we can uh, uh, make this more accessible to everyone is to really meet people in their agency, meet people in their strengths, and then see how we all can uh, work towards these goals of diversity, equity, and inclusion. It's very humbling, and it really feels like this award should be shared among the many people that have influenced my life. You know, beginning with my parents, my stepmother, my wife who's been one of my biggest supporters and doesn't always get the recognition, the ways in which I've seen my children um, also carry on these values and these ideals with their partners, and then lastly with my grandchildren. You know, just seeing that legacy that the things that I stand for, the things that my wife and I stand for, are being um, uh, transferred to the next generation and hopefully uh, giving a chance for us all to live into our um, strengths, live into the things that we bring to the table.